I want you to pretend that you are a boxer. It shouldn't be difficult to do. I remember the stories you used to tell me when I was a kid. Like that one where some punk tried to fight you. And so you chased him down, rounded a corner, and oh shit, found five other eager guys waiting to rumble with you. You told me after you rounded that corner, your eyebrows shot up, and you knew it was time to run. Sometimes it's like that. You round a corner and realize the other guy has more friends than you. Right now is no different. You have rounded a corner, and though it may feel like you're alone, you're not. The sickness is bad, but it does not have more friends than you. I think about another story. The young Ron who would walk around shirtless and angry looking for trouble. The young Ron who hopped on a motorcycle and found himself 200 feet in the air looking down at a motorcycle, mangled, so sure that this would be the last thing that he saw. You were wrong then. And if you've had similar thoughts recently, you are wrong now. For all the strength that you've had to rely on in the past, you will find more today. Because what time has taken in physical strength, it is replaced with things that love you and that you love. Hundreds of friends. A dedicated loving family. Kids, grandkids, co-workers, and people who have not yet had the luck of meeting you. For all of them, look into your center when your breathing feels labored. Keep your mind focused. Be gentle. Practice breathing with the patience that you would extend to others. Close your eyes and imagine your body healing itself. On the days where you don't feel like eating, feed yourself like you would feed your kids if they had not eaten all day. I want you to pretend you are a boxer. Do everything you need to get your body ready for the fight. You've got many rounds to go.